But Gugan gets two in two. Just how well is is he playing at the moment? Well, we we knew there was goals in him. I think uh, he's did been disappointed, but. Um, the pleasing thing, like I said, is that his CV shows that uh, he is a goal scorer in midfield. You know, he's not a fl- it's not a fluke or anything like that. He's got over 40 odd goals. Let's hope he goes on a run now. And um, one thing we do know, he can hit a ball that's stationary and he can hit a ball that's rolling as well and he can finish with both feet. I mean, he needs to maybe start getting one with his head now, maybe. Mm. Yeah. Now, th- there aren't many players, are there, who can start in midfield and legitimately start a season thinking I can get 10 or 15 goals? He's one of them. Well, I don't want to put him in the same bracket as 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 Frank Lampard, but you just see what Frank Lampard's done over his career. Is that he's got he's got that ability to be in the right place, but it's the technique as well. He can he can he sen- tends to just pass it in or timing the timing of runs in the box, which you want from the midfield players. It's 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 it's, it's reading situations, and uh, Lewis has done it fantastically well. And like I say, um, I would imagine he's want to get to the fifty mark. Go- Pretty quickly in goals, and then, and then hopefully get on the sixty. One thing we do know as well with with Lewis is he can hurt the opposition with a pass as well. He's, he's got a great range of passing as well. the uh, probably the best two players on the pitch the other night was probably Lewis McGugan and, and, and the boy for Brini for them. Yeah. It just shows um, how maybe good Watford's team is if them two can't get in that team. You know.